Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to do an unboxing of the M Audio SP2 Universal Sustain Pedal. I got this for I think it was $19.99, $20 $20 for my uh, Akai MPK61 keyboard. So we're going to unbox it and then we'll check it out and let you know how it works. So here we go. chose to go with a pedal that had um, more of a piano feel and I'm hoping this one has like a like um, looks like it's pretty well made actually I'm hoping it has like good spring and, more, and again more of a piano feel rather than just have a, a simple flat um, switch if you will type pedal this one looks um, pretty nice so let's see here yeah I mean it's got some pretty good weight to it and this is a metal pedal which is good. So it'll be durable. You got your cable here to plug into the uh, keyboard. And I uh, got some plastic on the pedal here. Looks like the pedal itself is protected, which is good. I'm going to keep it in good shape. And again, it's got, yeah, it's definitely got some um, tension to it. And it feels like a piano, which is good. Uh, so let's hook this up to the, uh, the keyboard and uh, see what it feels like and what it, how it works. One thing I forgot to point out was it has this actually plastic cover on it. I don't know if this is for shipping or it's to keep it on there. It kind of snaps in place and holds pretty tight. So maybe it's on there for use while you're using it to keep the pedal, which is metal, nice and shiny. And uh, not scratching up. So I'll leave it on there. It doesn't, it doesn't uh, impede um, you know, the, moving the switch down. You can see there's a little stopper right there. So we'll try to uh, hook this up to the keyboard and see how it works alright so I got my keyboard here and I basically hooked the uh, sustain pedal into one of the foot switch connections I have two of them on this keyboard so I hooked it into foot switch one and I've got it running down to six foot cable and then there's my foot switch right there the SP2 foot switch sitting there on my uh, Yankee my Yankee floor mat so anyway we'll give this a try and we'll see how it works all right, so first we'll do a piano demo, and we'll do uh, the first one will be without using the sustain pedal. See, I just stops very quick. So now I use the sustain pedal. Sending MIDI data fine to uh, my software, working great. So that's a piano. Let's try it with the organ. Or now we'll try it with a simple organ patch here. This is without. Obviously distinct notes. Now we'll do it using the pedal. Works just fine. Um, real responsive. It's got a like again. It's got a nice feel to it. It springs back just like a piano. Um, so you know, I've seen the smaller flat switches for around fifteen dollars, even twenty dollars, and this one is twenty bucks. All right. So conclusions. Um, this thing works great. Um, twenty bucks. It's got a metal pedal. It's real. It's real. It's stiff, so it gives you like a real piano type of feedback. And, uh, you know, I've seen other flat switches for around the same price. And, you know, provided this thing stands up, which all the reviews online are pretty good about it, I'd much prefer having a real pedal. So that's the M Audio SP2 sustain pedal. If you're looking for a sustain pedal, you might want to check this one out. Hope this was helpful. Please uh, comment and uh, subscribe. And thanks for watching.